This is a do-it-yourself video by Zombie Survival Blog. Welcome back, everybody. Today I'm going to be showing you the Altoid Survival Fishing Tin that we put together according to our needs and the area we live in. Uh, you can replace anything we have in here with something else you might need or the amounts of things we have in here according to what uh, better suits your needs. As you can see, we got some large hooks taped to the top of our tin to save some space, and so when you're reaching in for other things, you don't accidentally gore yourself pretty sharp. Uh, we have a small bobber right here. A little baggie full of essentials. Uh, small hooks, some weights, different sizes of bait. You, you never know, you might be unable to find the bait you need when you're actually out in the field. Or if you're really that hungry, you might be eating any insects you we'll be finding. Then we have a lighter, uh, starting fires, trimming lines, always great thing to have with you. Some steel wool, excellent fire starter for those of you that don't know. Small pair of tweezers. Some fire steel, in case you run out of fuel with your lighter small compass get yourself out of a tight spot a little pocket knife got some small scissors and of course a knife and we have our multi-use survival tool in here it's uh, got a knife edge it can be used as a screwdriver it's got some uh, a measuring stick on the side here multi-sided wrench and a saw also a great little tool if you can get your hands on one. We have our fishing line on a uh, piece of cardboard, that way it's not all over the place. A must. And some bandages, because you never know what you're going to get yourself into out there. Better safe than sorry. So that's our tin, and we'll see you next time.